All right, hello everybody. Today I want to talk to you a little bit about this Vickers Tango Down flat face trigger for the Glock platform. Been running it for a little while. I don't normally do a whole lot of upgrades to my Glocks. This is the only one I mess with and it's been a great trigger. So let's talk about it. Before we go any farther, really quick, I want to give a shout out to True Shot Gun Club. True Shot Gun Club is a phenomenal company. Uh, they have great prices and they offer their A Zone program, which is free shipping and uh, early, you know, emails that telling you what they're getting in stock, what they have in stock, and things like that. Uh, membership benefits of that sort. Uh, it is normally $99 a year. I have a discount code for you uh, of RTT20 for $20 off of that membership. So if, if you are a high volume shooter and you, you order a lot of ammo, it's absolutely worth the cost. I paid full price for my membership and I have saved in shipping twice over at least uh, in just this year alone. True Shot Gun Club has tons of package deals that have backpacks and ammo, knives and ammo, optics and ammo, things like that. And they're, again, their prices are great. With the current state of ammunition and especially the steel case, uh, the Russian ammo ban, we're going to see prices going up fairly soon, I would imagine. They said they will not be raising their prices until they absolutely have to be. So great company, great service, great prices. Check out True Shot Gun Club. A link will be in the tagged or the uh, pinned comment. Now let's get into the trigger. This is again the Vickers, the Vickers Tactical Tango Down flat face trigger. Uh, it's a great trigger. I have a lot of Tango Down stuff. I think Tango Down makes a lot of good stuff. Uh, I have their slide stop, the Vickers uh, Tango Down slide stop. I have the Vickers Tango Down um, mag release. And on my G43, I use the plus two base plates on my magazines and uh, they, again, are really great and have never failed me. So first, why do we want a flat face trigger? Well, you may or may not want a flat face trigger, but um, the benefits of a flat face trigger is the uh, ability to have a more uh, a more cons more consistent leverage on the trigger. A larger surface area that your finger will meet with and all of that equals more controllability and better shooting. Now on some curve triggers or on curve triggers, as you go around the curve, you're going to have different pull weights uh, because of how that curved leverage acts. And with the flat face trigger, you're going to have the same pull weight no matter where you're at on it. Now this has the little dongle, safety dongle, much like a Glock trigger does. And uh, it's a little bit smaller. It's not quite the full length. Some people I've heard complain about that trigger blade in uh, Glock pistols. So it's not the full length of the trigger like in a Glock. So it may or may not um, alleviate some of those complaints. Now, one of the best things about this trigger is not just its reliability. I've not had a single issue with it. I have seen on social media platforms, if I had a dollar for every time I saw somebody post a trigger, um, a post a problem with their, their pistol and it is the aftermarket trigger that they put in. I've not had a single problem with this in many thousands of rounds. I've had this for, I think, well, it's been well over a year. Um, it's been well over a year now. And uh, it's, I don't have any affiliation with Tango Down or Vick, Vickers Tactical. Uh, they don't know who I am. This is something that uh, I thought, well, it comes in at a super good price, so I'll give it a try. I've matched it up with, with the Ghost three and a half pound uh, connector, and it just makes for a very nice, crisp, lightweight shooter. Let's 
put a few rounds through it, see if I can get you some, some footage here, some view of the trigger working. It just has a very, very good feel to it, uh, very positive feel as far as how my finger interacts with the trigger. Uh, again, uh, 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 the, the curved, curved triggers tend to have, uh, depending on where you're at on the trigger itself, up or down, you'll have varying weights and varying leverage on it. And uh, the leverage on this feels very nice and consistent and of course the brake is the brake is in the ghost trigger but uh yeah it's very nice now one of the things about the tango down stuff that i've really liked is the price there they come in at a very uh, a, a very uh, affordable price range uh this one here i want to say and uh, I, I haven't looked at the price lately, but I want to say right around the 40 to $50 range is what I paid for this. I'll annotate it right here, the actual price during editing. Uh, but I want to say I paid right around 40 to $50 for this. And uh, I think it's as good, if not better than uh, a lot of the higher price triggers out there that you see on some of these Gucci Glocks and you still get the benefits of a flat face trigger. All right, everybody, that is it for the Tango Down Vickers Tactical Glock flat face trigger. Very affordable, very nice option, especially if you're looking for a flat face trigger. I've really enjoyed it. Um, again, it's been super reliable and comes in at a good price. Um, I'll put a link to this trigger somewhere. I'll put a link to uh, Tango Down down below and uh, check it out. If you're in the market for a flat face trigger, this is one that I can uh, highly suggest. All right, thanks for watching everybody. Don't forget to hit like, share, subscribe, hit that notification bell. Uh, all kinds of ways to support the channel. One big way is to leave a comment down below. Uh, that helps with the YouTube algorithm. Of course, share the video, uh, hit that hit all notifications so you can get more videos from me. And of course, there is Ko-Fi. Ko-Fi is a way to support the channel. It is a subscription service, much like Patreon and Subscribestar. However, uh, neither one of those platforms want me. So I'm on Ko-Fi and you can get behind the scenes and other various extra content that way as well. Don't forget to check out True Shot Gun Club. Um, I, 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 I hate fear tactics. I hate fear mongering when it comes to like the gun apocalypse and things like that. But uh, I think for a some amount of time, in the very near real future, we're looking at uh, some serious ammo issues. And right now you can still get ammo at a really good price from True Shot Gun Club, so check them out as well. Thanks for watching everybody, thanks to everybody that supports the channel, and we'll talk to you later.